Hi guys! Welcome to Reseteer! A cute little game where you run a, an item shop because you are a little girl who lost her parents and is massively in debt to this fairy who's going to take away your house if you don't pay up. So I've already played a week of this and I failed to pay the debt before the deadline. So, ooh, I've already died once. That's why I have two items here. And, uh... I made a lot of mistakes. This game punishes you for making mistakes. So we're in the Adventurer's Guild. Uh, this game also has a dungeon crawler aspect to it, where you go to dungeons to get new items. And, uh... I used to play this game as a kid. I'm, I don't know. Sometime in my early teens, maybe, my friend had it, and we would compete whenever I came over. Uh, she would play around and see how far she could make it, and how much of the debt she could pay off, and she was always better at it than, uh, than me. I could never make it past the first week, and apparently I haven't gotten any better in my years of not playing it, so... My friend, of course, was so much better because it was her aim, it was her computer, and she could just play it at home whenever she wanted, so... Uh, here's Louie, our little, uh, adventurer boy. Um, I'll try not to get him killed this time because we really need him to farm items. Um... I feel like I've gotten a bit of a better understanding of the game from from failing, but we'll see. So the first uh, payment is on the eighth day. We are on day two, so we have six days to make ten thousand. Uh, whatever the currency in this game is, I forgot. Pix, pixels. Pixies? Something with PIX. Yes. Oh, you're a skinner. I have fond memories of this game from playing it as a kid, but all right. That's why Louie is level 8. Um, Louie will start at level 1. Uh, but honestly, the level doesn't matter much. Oh. We actually have an item. Uh, from last time. Yeah, you can give him items. Oh. Wow. Let's give him some armor. Or... Wait, can I change out his equipment? Never try that. Let's keep these for now. We can sell them in the shop. This game is brutal. So... Louie needs money to, to become an adventurer. And these two just convinced them to go into a dungeon for them. And uh, they have no intention of paying him. They just want to take the items from the monster kills and basically leave this guy with nothing. They're kind of brutal. Also, if Louis gets injured, those two will just take the most valuable item and just run off leaving him injured. Uh... To the monsters, so he should now be equipped with better items. So, at first we just have slime, nothing fancy. The map is randomly generated, so the layout will change. There's traps all over the place. Okay, this time it wasn't a trap. This 
game's pretty difficult. Yeah. Okay, we leveled up and now let's not walk into slimes. Oh, what is that? Back scratcher. Can't imagine that being worth much. Okay, let's go find the exit. You I don't think there's a way to leave the dungeon unless you completely complete it. Which takes about the entire day. So you miss a day of selling items when you go to the dungeon. But if you have no items to sell, you can't really make profit, so you have to manage between going to the dungeon and selling items you get from the dungeon. And then you can also buy items from people that, that come to sell you items. So there's there's a lot of things to manage in this game. And new things might might show up after we Ooh, rocks fall, everyone dies. Yep. This dungeon is loaded with traps. Okay, that's just slime fluid. I don't know if that's good for anything. Uh -oh. So many slimes. Too many. Special attack. Now, uh, Louis has a regular attack and a special attack. This, reg this easy dungeon doesn't have a boss. I don't know if there are other dungeons. Uh, there, there are probably other dungeons that are more difficult. They might have bosses, I don't know. i just been running this dungeon because it's the easiest one and easy to get items. And, uh... Louis isn't e exactly very good at this basic dungeon later because he died so many times. Come on, pick up the weird item. I think he, Louis also needs better equipment, so sometimes it's better to save certain items that will make Louis stronger. Because if he dies, you can only keep one item, versus if he doesn't die, you get to keep all the items you found. So, cool. Green coat. Ah, uh, mystery item. Mystery ingredient. These red slimes are stronger, so they give more XP. There's other enemies, not just slimes. There's there's weird things with tentacles. And cows that, that shoot things at you. I, at least I think they're cows, I don't know. They look like cows to me. I think we're gonna encounter them in the next level. So, uh, these, I, I think they're cows. The ears and the the way the face is. I don't know. I think they're cows. Ah! Rocks. Ouch. Slime trap. No treasure. Uh, slime and a cow. Sometimes he will do a power attack on his own. He did it at a very convenient time this time. Good on you, Louie. You helped me out. A dead end. Nothing but slimes on this place. We gotta find treasure chests. Okay, we're doing pretty well. On this run, at least. We're at level 3 and I'm not dead. Oh no. But that might change in a few seconds. Okay. Level up. Oh yes, we healed completely. And he got a new attack because he's level 10? Ooh, nice. Okay. Stupid cow, stop it.
Okay, these summer sandals sell for a lot of money, I think. Okay. There's five floors in this dungeon, so the next floor is gonna be the exit. And these are the weird tentacle things. And rocks. Okay. I don't like the weird tentacle things. And I don't like the slime here. Okay. Cow, stop throwing stuff at me. I don't like you, get away from me. Really don't like the temple things. Let's just say I know too much about what tentacles do, and it's not fun. I used to watch anime. I know all about tentacles. This is a very anime style game. It even has Japanese voice acting. Get away from me. There still might be another treasure chest on this floor. Back off, tentacle monster. Why do the monsters... Well, maybe they do get killed by the rocks, actually. Oh, you got an apple. That's cool. Don't know if there's a way to heal. Uh, I don't need slime. There haven't been real people coming in demanding to buy slime. So I'm gonna say it's not thing that people actually want. There, since there's no demand for it, I don't see a reason to keep it in stock. Cow, back off. Okay, I guess there wasn't another treasure chest. Wait, there's a passageway beyond this. What's there? Cows. And slimes. Okay. I guess there's nothing else. We didn't get Louis killed this time. Awesome. And we got a huge treasure chest. Except you are a flying ball of greed. Yeah, there are adventurer guild cards, so we can get into the guild and be an official adventurer. So I guess we don't have to pay him money after all, he gets to be in the guild for free or something. Like that. Well, good for us and good for Louis. I already know how the door works, game. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we still have time in the day to sell things. Yep, we still have time to sell. Uh, that's only worth 300, but uh, the thing is, we can raise the price.
Yeah, I already know. Put some eye-catching items in there. It's sparkly, it's probably eye catching. Oh, can put this one there. Here. No, the atmosphere is pretty plain. I don't know, maybe later we can upgrade the shop. Um, summer sandals. A back scratcher is worth that much. Uh, chestnuts are food. No, they're not, I guess. Um, I want to put the food items here. Um, back off, dear. This is like if Tinkerbell was a loan shark. A treasure. This person wants an item. A wooden armband? That's a treasure. Uh, no, I guess not. Food. Sometimes people will ask for items. Wait, we do have food. So, the base price is 100. But, we can actually raise the price. And he's okay with it. Okay. We need to make 10,000. Okay, how much? Okay! He was okay with buying it. Book, we don't have books. This isn't a bookstore, this is... This is a weird... Item store that also sells food, I guess. And we can do this again. We still have time in the day. He wants it? Okay, we can raise it. Fair deal. You just got scammed, my man. And you think it was a fair deal. Uh, really? Okay, for you, I will sell it base price, because you're out there nearly getting killed for my profit. Your family suddenly needs food. Well, I have some cherries. That's probably not gonna feed the whole family. Oh, we can raise it to more than a thousand. Okay. And she was okay with that. Okay. Oh, he wants to sell this. Wow. Can, let's see how much I can knock the price off. Half the price? Oh, he took it! Wow! That's nice. Wow, these people are idiots. You guys are getting scammed and you're happy about it. We did pretty good. Okay. She's gonna explain something new. I don't really care about the tutorials. Um, I guess I can put that in there. Uh, we got some, uh, we got the uh, we got the candy apples. Sandals. Hey. 
actually might sell pretty well. Let's go to the dungeon, get more items. Okay. Let's go. We have a new dungeon unlocked, but I don't think Louie can handle it. Uh, at least until he has a better sword, so I'm gonna keep running this one. I wanna see if I, uh... I wanna see if I can get him something. And we have a huge debt we need to pay. So, that comes first. If I manage to get my hands on some better items... ...for Louie... Come on. You're level 10 and you're still getting beaten around by a bunch of slimes, dude. Maybe being a, an adventurer is not the right career choice for you, Louie. Okay, there should be another treasure chest. That's an exit. Good to know where that is. We're gonna need it. And I guess there's no other treasures. These guys are so annoying. You don't even drop me stuff anymore. Oh wait, there's another room we have gone into. Uh, this is for profit. Apple. Cool. Yeah, because sometimes people come in demanding stuff and it's usually food or weapons. There could be a treasure in here. Drop it. Yep, I was right, there's a treasure. A hat. Okay. Money. Free money. Wait, what happened to my 2000? Oh. Did these two actually pay Louie? Oh. I might have to change my entire strategy then. Oh my god. I didn't know going to the dungeon cost money. How did I never know this would cost money? I have 2,000. Oh, no wonder I couldn't make it. Okay. Going to the dungeon every day is not good. I'll need to change my strategy. Oh my god. Super bad. Super bad slimes. Not even letting me use my ability. Oh wait, because I don't have any energy. How is he so weak at level 10? Like, there's no difference between your strength. So I think he needs a better weapon. But weapons cost money! I don't feel like giving up items that have value. I mean, if we pay a thousand and we get items that are worth way more for free, so... It is good, but doing it every day, I guess, costs too much, because Louie needs to make an expense. Like... He needs to get paid, I guess. There's a... He's not doing it for free. He's not as stupid as most people. Like, the first time we talked him into doing it for free, and now he's, like, taking a fee. Because he's an official adventurer with the guild. Good on you, my man. You're not letting these two scammers scam the heck out of you. Oh, that's a longbow. Ouch. Louis' health has taken a pretty big dive. It would be cool if we could leave without dying. The only way I know is to either finish the dungeon or die. And I don't want to die. If we just got some items and we can leave whenever we want it. Now probably no point in fighting these anymore. And we're still pretty far from a level up. You know what, let's ignore him. Let's go after the treasure chests. Back off. Okay. 
And we already found the exit, okay. Let's find another treasure chest and let's make it back to the shop in time to sell something. Okay, we got out of that circle. How's our problem? Oh no, 20 health? Uh, let's get out of here. Too many monsters! Power attack wasn't even enough. These Mr. Ingredients are probably just slime floors or chestnuts dropping. Or I really dislike these cows or whatever. Oh, we got a better sword! Let's save that for Louie. Why did you have to move there as I'm trying to run away? Okay, whatever. We are out of here. We just have one more floor to get through. Hopefully we can earn a level. Not die. That would be awesome. Oh, exit. Immediately. Okay. If we could level up. Found an item. Forgot about these guys. We got some bread. And 9 HP left, oh my gosh. Uh, if we die, it's not gonna be good. So, let's go back. And we get to keep all these items. gonna be about the schedule. I thought we got food. Yep, we did. So we put that up for sale. And we have a full stock right now. Awesome. Okay, someone wants to buy this. Hey! We have a lot of money we need to make. Okay. Well, we're making some money. A treasure. I don't think we have one. What counts as a treasure? We have that statue on display, but it's super expensive and no one wants to buy it. Well, we got food in stock, don't we? Let's try to sell... Oh, I guess bread. Bread is food? Really? Those are girl sandals. Okay, I'll sell this at base price because it's silly. He's kind of working for us sometimes, so he gets an employee discount. We did pretty well, but we're nowhere near close to 10,000. I'll save the longsword for Louie. We don't have any more food items, do we? We have put something here that would attract more people. Let's add the staff. Back off, I want to put an item here. 
put the longbow in here. Is that the raincoat? Let's go. Time to sell. I'm gonna make profit. I need to make a lot of money. Oh, he wants it. Okay. Well, maybe I could have raised it to 70. We have half the sum we need. Really? I lowered the price. What are you upset about? You're stupid, kid. Ooh, that's very dumb. Can I add another... 50? Oh, cool. Okay. Slowly we're getting there. You wanna buy it? Okay, how about... This. Well, back off, kid. If you don't have any money, get out of the store. That's why kids are stupid. They never have enough money. Yeah, kids are like the worst customers. No, you're paying that price or you're getting out. I'm not lowering the price, brat. Get out. Food. I think I had something. Alright, finally sold something big. And we're pretty close to what we need. Final price, take it or leave it. Not running a freaking auction here, I'm running a store. Okay. Here you go, Louie. That's because you're getting that employee discount. Okay. Let's see if we can get this. Alright, we got 10,000. <laughs> okay. We still have four days to go. We probably need to make more than that. I don't know what this thing is used for, but if you want it, I'm not gonna raise the price too much. Just take that useless thing off my hands, please. Alright, all in all, doing pretty well this time around. Alright, still have some time. We're running low on items to sell. That one, same for Louie. We don't have any food, do we? So I'm gonna put some stuff in here. I don't think a chestnut is food, but okay. I'll put one here because it's a plus two, so it's more valuable. Seriously, stupid fairy, why you have to move in my way every single time? You want to sell this to me? Holy shit, I dropped it by a whole thousand and he took it? Hmm. 
You wanna buy it? Make sure you have enough money, kid. Okay, for once a kid that actually knows how to count. How about this? Okay, so... How about... This? Oh! Awesome! Doing pretty well. You wanna buy it? Are you sure you can afford it? gonna benefit him, so... Okay, let's sell some more stuff. Oh, you want it? Honestly? Oh! You can raise it by a whole hundred. Awesome! Just a chestnut. I don't know why people buy these. Okay. Doing pretty well. We still have some stuff to sell, but tomorrow we're gonna have to hit the dungeon. Ah, uh, we're running out of stuff fast. Your family needs a hat? Uh, sorry, I don't have one. I just sold all my hats. So how is your whole family gonna wear one hat? Like, you're gonna take days of the week wearing it or something? How does that work? You wanna sell walnut bread? Well... Let's say this much. Okay. Cool. Anybody wanna sell me a hat? Maybe that lady's gonna... Oh, you're gonna pay 2,000 for this. Oh, you're gonna overpay for this. And he was okay with that. Awesome! My first run did not go that well. I had so many people wanting to sell me stuff, and people wanting to buy stuff I don't have in stock. This, the second round is going so much better. Okay, we still have some expensive stew to sell. Let's see if that goes well. He wants it. Okay. Take that disgusting thing off my hands. Okay. Wow, we're doing this pretty well. I think I got the hang of it. Oh. Alright, wow. On our way to 20k. Oh, he's actually wearing the sandals and the bracelet he bought. Oh, so I'm not giving him any items for free. Then again... Okay. One item. <sighs> Should 
Should I try the new dungeon? No, nah, I'll try it for next week. That'll next next dungeon is gonna be for my next week. Yes. Oh boy. Okay, the new sword is better. Insta kill slimes. Oh, that armor. Maybe I would not take damage from slimes anymore. Also, I could stop walking into them, but that's never gonna happen. Well, he's already stronger with the new sword, so... Maybe we, we can hold off on the new armor. We don't need the freaking slimy stuff. Okay, people are buying it, I still don't know why. The other dungeon's gonna be too tough. I mean, I still keep dying in this one. Oh, the new sword is so much better. Oh, I'm a slime annihilator. Wow, that previous sword was so trash. Sure, better armor might do something. Okay. 16,000 in my first week. It, we're probably gonna have to pay like 20,000 next week. Because it's. From what I remember, the debt goes up. Like, in the first eight week, you have to pay eight, like uh, 10,000. Then on the second week, we're probably gonna have to pay like 20,000 or something. So it's gonna be double at least. Rocks twice in a row. Cool, we found the exit. Come on, slimes, you're stupid. Drop me items. Give me profit. You're stupid. Because you don't drop me anything. Yes, thank you. I need that. Cow? Stop it. Give me profit. Why is no one dropping me any items? Can dodge the rocks. No longer dying to the slimes as much, but the rocks are a problem. Stay away from me, rocks! Oh, piece of candy! Doing pretty well this time. What is that? A pot stand. Looked like an angel halo thing. That that is probably not worth much. But well. Why did why was that in a treasure chest? Like a pot stand in a treasure chest? Like, imagine playing something. And you find a treasure chest in a dungeon after beating the final boss. And inside it is just a pot stand. <laughs> it's not even made of gold or anything, it's just a regular metal pot stand and it's like... Yep. Without any explanation. Just... The biggest treasure of this dungeon is a friggin' pot stand. Now I'm gonna have to use that in a game next time we're playing with my friends. Just, uh... uh I imagine some people in the party will probably want to kill me, but... Great way to troll your friends while you're playing together.
the stuff. Fake, fake out treasure. That's probably one of the worst things you can do to any party, like... I mean, to be honest, it would probably take a couple of hours. People... People like to get hung up on details. Um... Remember we were... role-playing and... I was the... DM. I was hosting the game. And it... It was a puzzle that took me like five minutes to come up with. And... My friend spent two hours on it. And I'm just sitting there like... Oh, come on! It's not that e It's not that hard, like... And they're, like, getting hung up on completely, like, the wrong thing. They're focusing too much on, like, the details. Like, there there were two simple puzzles, like... Left is right, up is down, and they had to navigate through this kind of weird mist where you had to go in, a, in the different direction than you actually wanted to go to end up going the right way. And they got so confused by that. And then they ended up in this like magical elevator that the walls of the room uh, work by absorbing magic. And there were and it was just one of those very decorative rooms that had like gemstones in the floor and they were so focused on the gemstones. And and everything, and like, they were tapping the walls and like, pressing the gemstones and like, casting spells. <coughs> it was crazy. We spent two hours on the on examining the elevator. And me having to give the same description of everything over and over again, it was a nightmare. Like, it's regular gems in the floor. They don't do anything. They're not magical. <laughs> You just have to cast spells at the walls so it charges up and it's like, you spent two hours on this shit. It took me five minutes to come up with. Uh, it was crazy. Okay, we have a piece of candy. What else we got? Some random stuff. What is it? What is this pot stand? Why is it so expensive? It's made of cloth and cotton? Okay, why, why is that so expensive? I think next time my players piss me off, I'm just gonna put a hot pot in the treasure chest and give them no explanation as to why. We don't have enough food, so might as well put a helmet there. But yeah. I'm gonna buy this for your brother. Do you have the money? Can you afford it? Wow! You're one of those rare kids that actually has money. Okay. Oh, you wanna sell chocolate? You wanna give me you wanna give me candy? Wow, that's that's a terrible price. It's like nobody here went to school. Okay, Louie. Thank you. Oh, we need to take care of Louie. He's our little profit-making machine. I had a piece of candy. Candy is not- I have a chocolate bar. That's more expensive. I should probably- Yeah, I should probably try to sell that. Because it's more expensive and we can raise the price to- Ooh, 560? Yes. Awesome. You want to buy this? Okay. 500? Okay. We're doing pretty well. Making some good money here. Probably should have put the pots in there, but... 
You wanna buy this? Of course, Louie. Anything for my best dungeon boy? Well, so far you're my only dungeon boy. Apparently we can have other adventures. At some point. At least it looks that way. Fair deal, dude. You just paid way too much for that. But okay. A fair deal is a fair deal. And we're doing pretty good. We have two more days. Huh. I still have stuff to sell. Honestly, I should put this here. Uh, I'm gonna put that and the armor here. And let's put that here. And uh, people seem to be buying this slime fluid. Especially the better quality ones. So let's see how that goes. Oh, well, I thought Louie would buy it, but okay. Maybe he's gonna buy the armor. Uh, nope, someone else is. 2000. Can we go 2200? Man, what are you gonna do with that armor? Like, put it on an armor stand by your fireplace and have it look cool? You want the candy? Sure. Though, I wish you would've bought the armor. That would've been more beneficial for me. Because you could do harder dungeons that probably have better loot. You wanna buy a chestnut. Okay. It looks too spiky to eat. Okay, lowered it a little bit and he was fine. At least... We're making money. We didn't sell anything? We can change the walls? We don't have different walls. Where do I get walls? I want to make the store look nicer. Food. Well, I have a piece of candy. It's not exactly food. I mean... Even, even if you're really hungry, like, a piece of candy is gonna do nothing for you. Wow. We're doing pretty well. I really want to sell that statue. It's supposed to be worth like 5,000. So I could sell it for a whole bunch. Okay, that's cool. We have a pot stand, but that's probably not what she's looking for. Somebody needs to buy that super expensive pot stand. Food. Sorry. All sold out. Well, we had food. We sold out. Not my fault you came here too late. Okay, final day. Well, I'm pretty calm about that. We need to get stock for next week. Yeah, this is this is the day where if we don't pay up, we get our house taken away and it's game over. Hopefully that's not gonna happen. We have to twenty three K and unless we end up losing that somehow, we're good. Let's go to the dungeon. Why is that blinking? <laughs> Just to relax? Eh, we don't have time to relax. 
Okay, final dungeon run, and next week's dungeon is gonna be the Jade Way. like some cool boots. I hope we find another pot stand and I also hope we find some buyers for the one we currently have in stock because no one seems to be buying it. No one wants the super expensive pot stand that we got from a dungeon for some reason. Oh, cool. Egg toast. Oh, okay. Okay, that's like 2,000. Ooh, that's a good item. Uh. Come on, slimy, get out of the way. We don't need slime fluid, we already have too much of that. We have that one guy that comes in. You know, I don't want to know what he does with it. Also, the way that thing is shaped... Yeah. Makes me think of certain things. Not good things. Not safe for work things. It's a Japanese kind of anime style game. It wouldn't be too weird if they put something crazy like that in the game. Just as an easter egg or something. I mean, they put tentacle monsters. I mean, it's anime. You can't have anime without tentacle monsters. Even Pokemon did it, with tentacle evolving into tentacle and Misty. And Pokemon is like, okay, I guess Pokemon is not very family friendly. I mean, it's literally, Pokemon are like the animals of that world and they're capturing these animals and forcing them to fight each other. It's basically dog fights, but with like every type of animal that exists on the planet. They also eat Pokemon. Yeah, I guess Pokemon is not very kid friendly. Back here, the cow. Well, I guess the horns are only on its helmet. But I still don't know what that thing could be. It looks like it has hooves and those big floppy ears, though. Like a cow, though. I guess it's wearing gloves. But it doesn't have a tail. It's not green, so it can't be a goblin. I don't know what that thing is. Get away! I have two girls with me. Get away, tentacle monster.
Oh, you're the green one. Let's just level Louie up as much as we can because we're gonna be attempting a more difficult dungeon. Oh no! Oh no, you don't! I think we can get other ingredients from different dungeons, like, here we're only getting, like, slimes. Slime floats. Which look more like jelly to me. Depends on whether it's sticky slime or slippery slime, but it probably has its uses. <laughs> or if it's more like jello. Hey, stop pushing me around, stupid. How strong is that cow? Okay, we still have some paths we can take. I'm not gonna have any rocks dropped on me. It's been a while since that happened. I'm kinda getting suspicious. You like to push me, huh? How do you like being pushed around, huh, cow? There's another treasure chest here. There might be. Might not be anything. Oh, there is a chest! And a whole other section, too. Oh, another one of those super expensive statues that I can't even sell the one I have. Now I got another one! Another super expensive object I cannot sell because no one wants to buy it. But if, if someone eventually does come, it's gonna be like 5,000 in one. It's gonna be great. Chocolate. Awesome. That's like 800 that I'm gonna get for selling that. If you break everything down into money, I guess it becomes easy to play this game. It's just. playing Monopoly. This is like single player Monopoly. enough to- wait, we can- we can make it to level 12. I mean, come on. We're so close. We're pretty good on HP. Oh, I got- good thing I went back here. Okay, this cow is really stubborn. Can we get to level 12? Please. So many cows. Don't give you a whole lot of XP though. Oh, you're a blue one. Still not enough XP? Okay. But it's right, almost right there, level 12. Hopefully, I'm not gonna get myself killed. We can walk out of here with all the loot. The moment we level up, we're gonna heal. One more. Alright, level 12, awesome. Once we pay off that debt, it's gonna be the new dungeon. It's 
probably gonna be way tougher and probably gonna have some really awesome new loot that we've never seen before. And we're already getting some good stuff out of this one. Hard to imagine what's gonna be better. And we still have so much time to sell. Ooh, baby. I think we're gonna have the next week's dead ready before next week arrives. Oh, we're definitely on that. Let's put that in there. What are boots? Why not? Oh, we already have these two. Let's put that chestnut there. Do we have... We have food. Cherries are expensive. This is expensive. Next toast is expensive. Okay. Let's open up. See how much we can sell. You wanna buy this? Alright! Awesome! Something special. I wouldn't call this spiky thing special, but... Well, Yes, we paid off our debt for the week. And we have 13,000 left going into next week. And I'm gonna be getting into next week next time. If you enjoy watching me play this game, leave a like, subscribe, or consider checking out my Ko-fi page, link in the description, and I'll see you guys in the next one.